my channel. As you can see from the title of the video, today's video is going to be an end of summer clean with me. So today is the 11th of September. Just yesterday we came back from our holiday in Palma, in Mallorca, actually not Palma. In Mallorca, we were staying in the south of the island for a week and it was amazing. I need to close my laundry room. But yeah, we're just back. So as you guys know what it means, it's speed clean, clean and motivation. This is already my third um, washing machine on today and it's just afternoon. So sorry if the quality, it's a bit, I'm filming with my phone because I'm too lazy to get my camera. Sorry if in the whole video, I will look like this crazy, but this is a deep clean, like the amount of things we're gonna unpack our suitcase, wash the clothes. I'm gonna give a clean to Carlo's room because he's gonna be moved there this week to sleep by himself. So the room will need to be cleaned, yes. So I'm gonna go and do some grocery shopping because I need everything. Carlo started weaning since, I think it's like two weeks now, even more than two weeks, I'd say three weeks. And there is a lot. Anyways, for the weaning talk, all this kind of stuff, I'm gonna make another video. There's gonna be a lot of autumn stuff, a lot of housing videos, cause the house is not even half finished. There's still so much to do. Now that we're back, we're gonna stop being lazy cause summertime kind of like, there's so many things to do. The bathroom, our room, so many things to do. So we're gonna clean today. So if you still didn't subscribe, please do hit the notification bell down below. If you're into cleaning, organizing, decluttering, a lot of declutter. I'm gonna do all my winter wardrobe today. This is the right channel for you, and without further ado, let's get into the video. So let's start with a voiceover. I apologize for my voice, but I'm currently sick. So I'm gonna start with the unpacking of the suitcases. I like to put them back in my attic. So I'm just gonna remove everything. I'm gonna divide clothes that I need to wash, clothes that I need to put back, makeup, underwear, all this kind of stuff. And then I'm gonna bring everything in my laundry room. In my laundry room, I'm gonna divide color clothes and white clothes. Um, like I probably had to do like three, four washes that day because like light clothes, dark clothes, baby's clothes, all this kind of stuff. So then I went upstairs and I, because I'm in this provisional room and I still don't have my wardrobe ready, I did put um, in those vacuum bags my winter clothes. So I took them out and I'm going to put in the vacuum bag summer clothes that I don't use anymore and, and then when I need them I'll just take them back. So these are very handy, I can put them into boxes and I'll put them in my attic. Um, if I had my wardrobe ready I could store everything in there but because we're we still have to do our own bedroom. Um, this just saves so much space. <laughs> There's my cat, sorry. And then I'm gonna declutter clothes. Like, I'm so bad at decluttering clothes. I like to keep everything in case I wear them. But I was just realistic and I'm gonna do a bag of clothes that I can donate. here that's gonna use father's jacket and there's my little baby so this is the bag of clothes i'm gonna donate there's probably gonna be more 
the wardrobe i don't really care if it's not neat the reason why i didn't organize it and stuff like that is because we're gonna move room soon i'm gonna go to the other room and this is not gonna be my wardrobe because we're gonna have another wardrobe so it's kind of like provisional i have so many things yes um these these are the clothes for like summer these are some old clothes for the baby suitcases and these will all need to go in the attic so then I had to make a quick trip to do grocery shopping. I usually go to Dunce in the town where I always go, but because I moved house, that town is 20, 25 minutes. Um, and I went to another town, but there's no Dunce, there's everything. So I went to Tesco, bought so much stuff, um, a lot of baby stuff, because obviously we're weaning. Then we had lunch, so quick break. And then I'm gonna clean the kitchen after lunch. We're still on the hunt for a dining table. Um, I did see a few, one I fell in love with, but it was sold out, obviously. The other one wasn't really sure. So now that we're gonna go shopping again, we need a lot of things, console tables, a nice dining table. I ordered some kitchen stools, so we still need so much stuff. So I'm gonna clean the table and I'm gonna put a dishwasher on. So I'm going to clean the sink with some Sif and flash spray. Absolutely love this black sink. Only thing about the kitchen, because it's matte black, it's so hard to clean, gets dirty so easily. I knew this, but I love matte kitchen. Still, a lot of things need to be finished in the kitchen. So the dining table, um, we need to get the built-in microwave oven, because I have my old microwave oven. Um, some new chairs, like there's still a few bits to be done. And then we're gonna clean around the kitchen. I'm still on the hunt for a good um, marm worktop cleaner. Um, as I usually just use water because I'm scared they get ruined. I already ruined a little bit on the kitchen island. That was my fault because I left a product sitting on top of it. Um, but yeah, so I'm gonna clean the hob and just everywhere. Kitchen takes long because obviously we're here every day. And after I'm cleaning the kitchen, the island, the worktops, I'm gonna hoover and mop.
So I decided to clean this top drawer where I keep like sauces, pasta, because it was a mess. I usually put like stocks in it, onions, uh, garlic, pasta, like oil, this kind of stuff. So I decided to reorganize it because it was pissing me off. Show me what you want to see. Maybe I can change. Maybe I can change. So then I decided to wash Carlo's bottles, toys, all this kind of stuff and I'm still sterilizing his bottles. Doesn't really make sense because I don't sterilize um, his plates where he eats like food but I don't know I just have this habit of sterilizing bottles um but again like maybe with the milk that becomes dry it's just easier um so yeah obviously we don't use as Bunny's bottles anymore because he's weaning so uh he drinks less milk but just this just takes a few minutes and I sterilize him in the microwave as their man bottles Lonely, I just sit and weep Love me now or let me leave Endless pain, it's all I know Hurt me more or let me go In this game, my heart will lose Change your ways or set me loose Pain, it's all I know. 
hurt me more or let me go In this game my heart will lose Change your ways or set me loose Change your ways or set me loose Cold eyes So then I went into the nursery room. I decided to give this room a deep clean. Obviously I always clean it, but a deep clean because I'm gonna move Carlo here this week to sleep by himself. He's six months now, so he is ready to move in his own room. So I had some suitcases left. I'm just checking if there's something inside and we're gonna put them up in the attic. And then I'm just gonna clean around. So obviously I'm gonna dust the room as it was very dusty and I'm going to reorganize his drawers so see if there's enough nappies, wipes, um, like reorganize all his products and stuff like that. I'm going to clean the top of this drawer so where the changing mat is and obviously sanitize everything because he always gets changed here and just clean all the furniture. And I'm gonna go over to his wardrobe and I'm gonna take out the clothes that don't fit him anymore, which are loads. Um, and I'm gonna put new clothes in. We received so many presents when we went to Italy, like I literally had to get them shipped uh, over here. Um, so many clothes for all, all my friends, family. So I'm gonna put in um, under vacuum bag all his old clothes. And I'm gonna put them in the attic. I know when you have another child you might buy a lot of stuff but you know I couldn't reuse some of them I can donate them a lot of these things are nice presents I want to keep even designer stuff that was gifted to me so um obviously because I'm not going to use them for another while until I have another baby um it's nice to put them under vacuum because if you only fold them they might get ruined whereas if you put them under vacuum so yes then I'm going to empty the bin bag and I'm just going to clean around with my Mr Sheen absolute favorite product so I'm gonna clean the mirror the walls the shelves windows We are in Carlo's room. I'm gonna give a clean to this room. I need to wash these sheets because he's gonna be moving to this big bed. Um, obviously, I'm gonna remove all this when he sleeps, but he's gonna be moving here to his own bedroom. And this bag here, it's a um, vacuum bag. I need to put this in my attic. These are all the clothes that don't fit him anymore. It's still open because I need to add some holiday clothes that are drying. And then we can close it and pop it up. And we're just gonna clean, make this room cozy and clean for Carlo to move here.
So then I'm going to hoover a mop. I'm using my flash mop here because I already hoover a mop this room yesterday. So just redoing it. Also changing the bed and uh, washing the sheets because obviously he has to move here. <laughs> So guys, this is the end of the video. Sorry if it's a short one, but I will have longer ones, autumn decor coming up. And as usual, thank you for keeping me company. Cannot wait for autumn, end of the summer, a lot of autumn -y videos. I'm so excited for the cozy vibes. And yes, thank you for keeping me company. And I hope I gave you a lot of cleaning motivation and I'll see you in my next video. Bye-bye.